Hello everyone. In this session, we will discuss the important topic of the stator construction is the slots. So before discussing the slots, why, what, are, what is the slot first? What is the, how it is used? Generally, slot is the thing which is useful for carry the stator winding. Useful for carry the stator winding. Not only stator winding, the rotor also consisting of the slots. But now we are using the winding, stator or rotor. So when we are discussing about the stator core, if you observe here, these are the stator core. For example, if you take one thing, if you take one, one pole. So it's like, look like this, one pole look like this. So generally here, here so in order to produce for example if you consider opposite poles two so this is the one pole and this is the one pole yes so here to produce we should one should be at north one should be at south so to produce this north pole and south pole and we should give some winding so for that winding we should keep the we should give the slots we should arrange the slots these carry the winding he is known as the slots he is known as the slots and here also these are the slots which is useful for carry the winding carry the winding okay so whenever we are giving the supply to this for example if we are giving some AC supply some AC supply to this then currents will flow these currents will produce flux that flux from right hand thumb roll always flux lines from north pole to south pole so now we are discussing about these things these are the slots so if there is no slots means there is no winding there is no winding means there is no poles formation if there is no poles formation means there is no flux so our intention is to provide the flux that's why we should discuss about the slots here we have the slots discussion of slots is first time and which is very much useful to carry the winding okay here here so we already discussed about the slots we have some types of slots are available types of slots are available so first slot is open type slot that means here the slot construction is it's like look like open it's look like open here the slot is there it's look like open from this the winding will be this or this the winding is this the current is going inside if this is a dot then current is coming outside wind is going inside current is coming outside okay so if the construction is like this these are called the open type slots so and we have another two types is there another is the semi open type slot and third slot is the closed type slots we have these three types of slots the first slot is open type slots it look like open open look like open and there is a and we have there is a a winding construction is there for open loop there is a winding construction is there so so what is the look at the characteristics of the open type slot first it is access to large coil is possible so it's look like open there is a large number of coils first what is coil coil and coil is nothing but coil is which, which consisting of the collection of conductors it consisting of the coil is look like this this is the one conductor and the ending and ending with this point it, which will give into some phase this is the one coil the another coil also like this which has this is represents the another coil this is the coil one and this is the coil two coil one and the coil two 
coil construction is like in this coil only the current will be travels like this current will be travels like this okay so it is access to large coils is possible large number of coils will be inserted in this open type of slots winding procedure is simple and easy for the open type slots there is no problem with the winding winding procedure means by giving the winding to the giving the winding to the stator is very easy okay and we have leakage reactance is there so it is open type just just observe here it is a open type slot air gap is high air gap is high and the leakage flux linkages is less so so here flux lines flux is flux is free flux is free and and we have leakage reactance is low leakage reactance is low okay and that's why the maximum torque of the motor will be increases the maximum torque is inversely proportional to the leakage reactance and starting torque also improved the starting torque also inversely proportional to the leakage reactance here generally the leakage reactance equal to frequency into leakage inductance leakage inductance what is leakage inductance as simply it will depends on the flux for example there is a some space here some flux lines are going and the same space the flux lines will be increases more flux lines here here less flux lines that means leakage reactance is less here here high flux lines leakage reactance is more here so that will represents the leakage reactance okay that's why the leakage reactance offered by open type slot is less so here the open type slot is there so that's why the leakage reactance offered by the slot is less as a result maximum torque and starting torque are more both will be increased okay so this is about the open type slot so simply the open type slot consisting of the maximum torque as well as the starting torque is high next it has some disadvantages those are average length air gap is more here air gap is very very high the machine draws high magnetizing current it requires more current because generally just take it they it is a normal for example just assume like this not that format for example this format is there this is supply if leakage flux is high so always we should maintain flux will be constant at the air gap flux will be constant at the air gap here here the leakage flux is high that means to produce to maintain the flux is constant and it draws the heavy magnetizing current draws the heavy magnetizing current that's why it require more current although starting torque and starting torque will be increases but it require more magnetizing current that is the problem with that so average length length of the air gap is more so machine draws high magnetizing current so why with that it has poor starting and running power factors so these power factors starting power fact and the running power factor are are also less starting and running are also poor both are the poor so that is the problem with that next the flux distribution is also non uniform so wherever the open type slots is there that means flux dis distribution always almost constant like this flux is constant distribution but here this the, the flux distribution is not constant up and downs are possible so up and downs is possible that's why the flux distribution is non uniform by that non uniform it will get it will give not con constant flux and 
harmonic torque will be produced in this what is the problem with that harmonic torque will be produced then due to that there is a noise and vibration will be increases by using the open type slots harmonics will be what is harmonics unwanted frequency signals will be produced these unwanted frequency signals due to that harmonic torque will be produced due to that the noise and vibration of the induction machine will be increases so these are the problems disadvantages with the open type slots the first disadvantage is it draws more magnetizing currents that why that's why the power factor is poor and the flux distribution is non uniform flux distribution and third is harmonic torques will be increases and noise and vibration will be increases so this is about the open type slots of the induction machines i hope all of you understand the session thank you